your hair is fake. <laughs> hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. But today we're gonna be doing the assumptions video. This is like a trendy YouTube thing that's been going on for about, I think like the last couple of weeks. I think the first person I saw do it was like Avery Ovard, something like that. Avery? Yeah, Avery Alvard, yep. So yeah, so honestly, a lot of the YouTube videos that I've watched on this are have been like with like more well-known, famous YouTubers. And I'm just a wee little YouTuber just starting out, so I was worried that I wasn't really gonna get many responses on the assumptions, but I did. I thought I was gonna get maybe like five. I got like 18, <laughs> so that's cool. I'm gonna be telling you whether these assumptions are right or they're wrong. So we'll, um, we'll go ahead and I have a screenshots of it. <laughs> I don't even know where to start. Like, <laughs> uh, you're single. Yes, I am single. <laughs> um, you don't like living in Utah. Okay, this one, um, I do like living in Utah now, but for the first like two to maybe even three years, like it's really only been, it's only, really only been the last like year where I've actually been like, okay, like Utah's cool, I really like it, it's fun, it's fun. But it's not really necessarily like, it wasn't really Utah itself that I was bothered by. It was more so like I was having my own issues, which made me be like, have like resentment for Utah just because of where I personally was at. I really like Utah now, it's beautiful. I love the Four Seasons. Um, I've met some incredible people here. I've had a lot of great opportunities here and a lot of growth. So it's not the absolute favorite place I've ever lived in, but I like living here. <laughs> you love golden retrievers. True. I can't wait to own one one day. <laughs> you go on a lot of dates. Um, I don't really know how to define like a lot of dates. like. I do go out on dates. Like, I don't, mm, I mean, I, what, like, what's a lot, you know? Like, what's a lot? Okay. You're confident. Yes, I, I am confident now. I honestly, co this confidence has developed really the last, like, six months. I really enjoy who I am and um, think highly of myself now, but honestly, it was not always like that. I struggled for a long, long time. Um, Obviously when I was a teenager, a lot of a lot of girls and a lot of guys, like they struggle with um, how they look, you know, who they are, and they just have a hard time figuring out how to perceive themselves. I don't really know. That was me. I just had a really hard time, you know, accepting how I looked and um, how I acted and just like who I was. I had to go through a lot of struggle and a lot of growth to get to where I'm at now, and I'm only hoping that I just keep growing. You slash your family are rich. No. <laughs> okay, first of all, I myself am not rich. <laughs> I actually have to work two jobs. I work really hard for everything that I have. Um, and even then, like, it's, um, like, I'm sometimes, some months, I'm barely scraping by. When it comes to my family, I wouldn't really say that we're rich. Like my dad has always been a really great provider. I never had to worry about when I was getting my next meal. I always had a place to sleep. I always had clothes on my back. I'm definitely blessed. My dad and my parents, well, not, sorry, mom, you did a lot too, sorry. My parents took really great care of me and my siblings. They worked hard to give us a great life. And so now my dad helps pay for my phone bill thank you, and I'm on their health insurance. Everything else I take care of myself, the other bills. We love adulthood. You want to be famous. <laughs> no, I don't want to be famous. I think this probably has to do with the fact that I have a YouTube channel, but no, I, YouTube has been very therapeutic for me. I really enjoy filming and I really enjoy editing and making people laugh and entertaining people. So it's never because I'm hoping that people will notice how cool I can be. Ew. Yeah, I don't know. It's, it's not, I'm not in it for the money or the fame, so yeah. You have a lot of friends and you always have. Um. I would say, like, I do have a lot of friends. Yeah, like, I, so I. So I, I have so many friends, yeah. No, like, that's annoying as anything. Ew. 
have lived in multiple different places. Um, I've lived in Utah for almost four years now. I lived in Idaho for a little over a year and then I grew up in Washington and I have friends in all three of those places. Um, uh, of course other places as well since everyone has kind of moved on with life. I guess I've always been like a pretty friend like oriented person like I have always had like friends um, but for a while there a couple years ago I had only like a few close friends that I really like talk to and really like I don't know I used to isolate myself a lot um, which wasn't really good for me I still enjoy my alone time but I am much better about spending time with my friends to all my friends out there I love ya you're the greatest don't know what I would do without you uh, Let's see. You <laughs> you kissed that dude from your first date vid. Did we kiss Hunter? I don't know. I don't. I don't know. <laughs> You're religious. Yeah, I am religious. I am a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter Day Saints. I grew up. I grew up a member of that church, um, and I still practice it to this day. Um, I've definitely have gone through waves of where it's been hard for me to go and to this day, you know, it's still hard. It's still hard to, you know, do the things that I know are right and um, I definitely by no means am perfect. I am mm, far, farthest thing from it, but yes, I am religious. I believe in God. Um, I'm Christian and yep, 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 yep. I assume Jenny is your favorite sibling. This is... <laughs> okay, so I have three siblings. There's Jessica, Jason, and Jenny. My relationships with all my siblings are different. Is Jenny my favorite sibling? I can't say that. Like, she's like one of my best friends. We have a lot of fun together and, you know, we're the closest in age, but I can't say she's my favorite. She's gonna be mad that I'm saying this, but I love all of them. They're all, they're all my favorite. <laughs> you pour your milk before your cereal. What the fuck? What, what? What? Um, no. <laughs> I uh, pour my cereal before my milk. I don't know what psycho does the other way. Sorry, no offense, but like, that's kind of weird. You are the best friend in the entire freaking world. <laughs> that's you, Sharice, that you're a basic. <laughs> you know, sometimes I can be pretty basic. I'm not gonna lie, like that's like a, that's a real thing, like, yeah. Your hair is fake. <laughs> um, I get this kind of a lot. Like I have people at work who are like, oh, are those extensions? No, this is my real hair. There's no, I don't, no clips, no clips, no clips. My hair is real. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> what the freak. I got this a few times. You're a gutta, you're a gutta and then gutta. <laughs> yeah, I'm a gutta, no doubt. That, that, that's me, so. Okay guys, thank you so, so much for coming and learning a little bit more about me. Um, and thank you to the people who made these assumptions. A lot of these, I feel like, you know, a good portion of them were pretty, you know, pretty straight on, but there are some that, nah, no, not so much maybe. Actually, most of them, maybe not. I don't know, it's like a good, it was like a good half and half. If you guys have any more questions about me, don't, you know, don't hesitate to ask. I, I am not easily offended, so yeah, please ask me anything. I'm an, I'm an open book. I hope you guys are doing great and having, um, are, are, had a good week this last week and are ready to go take on another, another week. Positive thought for this week is to remember that there's little comfort in growth and little growth in comfort. So step out of your comfort zone and, you know, make a new friend this week. Talk to someone, um, go out and run a mile. Something I should do that I'm honestly probably not going to do. But yes, so just um, push yourself this week to be better. Always try to be better. And I will see you guys next Sunday. You can't stop the tears from falling down. Wow, I don't know who I am.